After calling T.I. a snitch and a bum, Lil Pump seems to have a beef with the Atlanta rap icon. The Gucci gang rapper made the derogatory remarks on Instagram Live on Tuesday, March 21st. He also discussed his recent paperwork party and the controversy surrounding Tip's admission that he once pinned a gun case on his deceased relative. T.I. is a spy, he declared. Therefore, I never want to see him arrive with any of those pointless paperworks and crap. We are aware that you are a spy, T.I. Even the newspapers were brought to your stupid-ass comedy performance, which nobody fucking attends. You're a jerk. T.I. has not yet responded, so it's unknown what provoked the verbal assault against him. Since recording a Crime Stoppers advertisement as part of his plea agreement in his 2007 gun case, T.I. has been plagued by claims that he has been snitching. The rapper could have received a 10-year prison term, but only received a one-year, one-day punishment. After a resurfaced clip from a 2020 episode of his Expeditiously podcast revealed Tip admitting to pinning a gun case on his deceased cousin Toot in the early 2000s to escape going to prison, the scrutiny has increased recently. He said he talked with Toot, who died before the case went to trial, and that the deceased person gave him the go-ahead to inform law enforcement that the gun belonged to him. Boozy Badass, a well-known opponent of snitching, was offended by T.I.'s remarks, he called him a rat and scrapped their planned collaborative record. The Baton Rouge native said to Vlad TV, I don't spare no motherfucking body, because if you're doing anything wrong, you're doing anything criminal and you cooperate with law enforcement to get you out of jail, that means you're cooperating. It follows that you are a rodent. T.I. organized a paperwork party in his hometown of Atlanta as retaliation, where he was seen displaying court records that he claimed proved he didn't inform on his deceased relative. The paperwork states that the case was resolved due to a motion to suppress all of the evidence because of an illegal search and seizure, as the Grand Hustle General explained in an interview with Trap News Networks. However, Tip's attempts to clear his name were unsuccessful because Boozy Badass refused to accept his invitation to the gathering. Instead, he was watching the Atlanta Hawks play the Cleveland Cavaliers from courtside at the state.